and we're out in the middle of Botany Bay and we've got a big school of tailor working. Put a bit of heat on it. Oh, I'm on. Triple hook up. Oh, triple hook up. Yeah. Right, lift him in. Yep, just lift him up and in when he's on the surface. Now these little bumper bar lures are good quality little lure and work extremely well and catch me a lot of fish. Um, simply cast them across the surface if the fish are feeding up high and you can see them or simply allow them to sink if the fish have gone down deep and do a fast retrieve. Bumper bars come from a 15 all the way up to a 75 but the smaller end, 15s through to 35s, are ideal as tailor tend to feed on smaller baits in our bays, rivers and estuaries. Now the outfit I was using today was a 4000 OC Shimano bait runner. It's a great little reel. The rod that I've got matched to that is the Shimano Bushy 732 snapper and it's a great combination. There's a big school of tailor right under the boat at the moment but they're mainly small fish. But a lot of fun. Now tailor are very easy to fillet, they're a pelagic fish and we catch them around our estuaries and along our ocean rocks and they are a fantastic eating fish as long as you eat them fresh. Now this fish has been bled and put onto ice and gilled and gutted as you can see. So the simplest way to fillet, I'll just turn him around, is I come under this small fin here and drive the knife forward towards the head and then that removes that section. Drop the knife in down to the backbone and then just slowly take your time and work it all the way through the fillet. Now downward pressure against the backbone and there you have it. Very simple to fillet. Turn him over and do exactly the same on the other side. Come in round behind that fillet, drop the knife down, a nice sharp knife works well. Again, against the backbone, take your time and come right out through the fillet. And there you have two beautiful fillets of fresh tailor ready to cook. We're going to grill them today. 
Now what you need to, to do is obviously our tailor fillets, some olive oil, a little bit of seasonal salt, or if you haven't got that, salt and pepper will do fine. Some aluminium foil and a nice tray to cook your fillets on. So let's get started. So we'll just move everything aside for a second. And move our tray into place. What I do first is take a nice piece of foil and lay that on my tray. Then add your two fillets, like so. A little bit of olive oil, not too much. Then with your fingers, just gently rub that oil over the fillets. Now these two fillets, I've left the skin on and the scale on, and in one of our other clips you'll see exactly how to fillet tailor. And that'll show you exactly what to do. So there we have that, oil's nicely coated. So we'll do one with the seasonal salt. Just a nice light coating, not too much. And the other one we'll do with a little bit of salt and pepper. Okay, I've got my two tailor fillets. It's time to pop them in the oven. I've got the grill set at 180 degrees and I reckon they'll take anywhere between five to seven minutes. Once they're nice and golden brown, you pull them out and they're ready to eat. Well, the tailor fillets have been in now for about five to seven minutes. So let's check them. I'll tell you what, they look fantastic. Okay, you can see our fillets, they're sitting on the foil. I've just put them straight onto the plate, left them on the foil. And what you'll see is the flesh very easily pulls away from the skin. You can see the skin there is attached to the foil. It sticks to the foil, nice and easy. Well, there you have it, guys. Taylor fillets done under the grill, too simple. Now, tune in next week for another fantastic clip on the hook and the cook, and remember to subscribe. Cheers.